Welcome back, guys. For many who don't know, Def Grips are a hip-hop sensation based from California, consisting of homeless man Stephen Brunette and two random dudes on skins and tubs and a MacBook. While listening to hit song Locked Doors off their quadruple platinum album No Love Deep Web, I noticed something was off. To show you what I mean, I'll play this audio clip for you right now. Now this might sound confusing at first, but I've taken the liberty of cleaning up this audio track for you, and it's haunting. This is truly haunting what you're about to hear. So right now I'm going to play this again for you, but you're going to hear it be different because I've enhanced the audio and made it more clear what they're saying in this very moment right now. Now this may not be alarming at first, but I assure you this has a purpose, a reasoning behind all of this. With my definitive IQ, I will personally take you into the bowels of this dark and dirty secret. For those who don't know, Destroya is a monster from Toku blockbuster Godzilla, Mothra, Gamera, Destroya. Destroy all monsters melee unleashed. The unleash is important, as unleash is a Korean edition of the movie where Destroya is the final enemy and not Gorgo, who wasn't included in the title for some dumb reason. I don't know what Toho was thinking. It's clearly on the cover. Why wasn't it in the name? Anyways, Destroya is important because Death Gripes made a direct reference to him in the locked doors. You could call it a simple reference from a lifelong fan, but I'll burn the wax for you and reveal the wick. Destroya is a mutated crustacean from the oxygen detonator that killed the original Godzilla back in 1654, same day that Queen Christina converts to Catholicism. Basically, Destroya is a crab. Why does this matter? Originally, I thought it didn't. Then I heard this clip from their song, Hacked, which I will now play for you in stunning HD clarity. Teach him bitches how to swim. <laughs> if you don't get it yet, they're talking about crabs, dragging people underwater to feast on them. And if they don't learn how to swim, they will sink. Does it make sense now? Death Grips is heading some sick cult that worships crab people who walk among us and wants to drag us down. Destroy us, their poster child, the nefarious bastard capable of defeating Godzilla himself. He's real. He is out there. And in quoting him, Dead Gripes confirmed their allegiance to the highly evolved beings. They're warning us, people, and if we do not act now, soon our homes, our schools, our hospitals, the White House, our entire continent will be drugged down by them. Do you think Atlantis was just an accident? That was a fucking warning shot, and what they will do to us will make Atlantis look like a fucking joke. Heed my warning, people. The end times are near.